The first phase of construction of the new Mogadishu court and the police complex is underway. The foundation stone for the complex was laid in the capital Mogadishu at a ceremony presided over by the Somalia Prime Minister Omar Abdi Rashid Ali, Dutch Ambassador to Somalia, Franz Marken, senior United Nations officials and senior officials from the federal government of Somalia. The project is a key component of the Global Maritime Crime Program of the United Nations Office on Drug and Crime, which was originally launched in 2009 to provide support for the trials of piracy suspects in East Africa. The foundation of a new grand complex of Mogadishu is a major investment of United Nations rule of law in Somalia. This first phase of the Grand Complex is going to be ready in the next 12 months that judges and prosecutors will be able to handle proper trial in proper facilities. Trials of high-risk suspects are projected to begin in the middle of 2017. When complete, the complex will provide accommodation for suspects and inmates near secure courthouse facilities to reduce the need to transport prisoners through Mogadishu, which exposes them and correction officers to risk of violent attacks. This is not going to be only a punishing facility, it will serve as a correctional facility so that the offenders can reintegrate back to the community. The UN Office for Project Services produced designs for the facility in consultation with the UNODC and is overseeing construction of the complex, which is expected to be completed by early 2018. The prison will be equipped with 1,000 beds and meet international human rights standards. Three medium security cell blocks will be erected during the third and fourth phases of construction. The foundation of the new crime complex of Mogadishu is the major investment of United Nations rule of law in Somalia for the time being. We are going to start building the first phase out of three that are coming in the very next year. This uh, first phase of the crime complex is going to be ready in the next 12 months and judges and prosecutors will be able to handle proper trials in proper facilities. The project is being undertaken within the structure of the Somali Joint Rule of Law Program under the Somali New Deal Compact's Peace and State Building Goal 3 that focuses on justice issues. Trix Ingado, KTN News.